Hey, orange one here. We're going to be playing a little bit of Phantom Brigade. This is a really awesome game. Um, I actually got this key uh, for free. So yeah, the uh, de developers, if you're watching this, thank you. Uh, if you guys end up buying it, let me know. I, I always am curious if anyone <laughs> does end up buying things. <laughs> um, but when I'm, I'm playing them, it's just kind of one of those things I'm like, I wonder. If that does ever result with like a channel my size, if they ever do get any sales off of it, I'm you know like those big ones, it's like yeah for sure, they're gonna get some sales, but like, let's see, so yeah, let's go ahead suit up and make battle preparations. So yeah, I'm I'm skipping ahead of the tutorial because I've seen other people play through it. And it's like, it's a really good tutorial, but <laughs> let's go ahead and jump into some of the actual game because this is a really cool game. It has like some kind of procedural elements. It's kind of like Into the Breach, but like way bigger. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> like in terms of everything feels bigger. The scale of things actually is kind of smaller. And I think Into the Breach, like you're max to the size of city blocks not like buildings but this is what we've got here we've got these guys that we're attacking they're apparently some invaders it's very vague they don't really give a lot of specifics they're trying to be you know on the safe side i guess but we got ourselves our units here and there so we've got uh number uh we've got these two and we've got these tanks so you can kind of see like basically as we move you can see how they're going to try and attack us so they're gonna be trying to kind of get him so if we let's see I've got my assault mech here and my shield mech I feel like they want the shield mech to take these guys out out but i think the shield mech what we can do is kind of get him like and if we did that are we gonna get hit by them yeah they're gonna shoot at us like right away anyways so hold up so you right click on this little timeline thing and it gives you like attacks and you can like move and attack at the same time. So you have to be kind of strategic about it. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to run you up kind of like that. And so let's see, we're going to have shots on us around here. So while that's happening, we want to have our shield going. Let's get the shield. I think I'm taking like fire there. So let's start it. Um, like, hold on. Right. And then it basically says, what do you want me to point the shield at? And you have to like pick an enemy. So hold on. This. Yeah, we're gonna want it like here. And then I think we want to have it facing you. Yeah, like that. So then we'll end up getting kind of like here. Are we gonna take more fire? Kind of, but our shield should be up. Maybe let's just have another shield immediately afterwards. So it's just then have it facing uh, you because you're going to be the one firing at us, right? Yeah. Okay, so he's taking fire. While he's taking fire, you're going to be attacking. So if I want to be in attacking distance, when do I have a good shot? I'll have a shot around there with my... Oh, hold on now. I just run up a little bit further then. Okay, we don't have like line of sight until like that. 
maybe? Do I not have, like, an actual shot? I do not have an actual shot. Okay, hold on. Can I kind of, like, flank them? Uh, not really. It does not look like I'm going to be able to. Okay, let's reevaluate this. So if I kind of run here, and then we're going to what? Try and shoot them there, but there that's like after the turn ends basically. Can I do that then? Yeah, I can. I can do that then, but that's like basically my only attack. Hold on. Let's see. Can you run there? And then after that, can you get a shot then? I want that. And then as soon as you get into my secondary, maybe we can run up a little bit more. Hold on. And we'll get our secondary attack. Yeah, that should be pretty good. Alright, let's do it. So he's taking shots, good job. And then that just took some more damage, so that's pretty good. Alright, so we need to finish this guy off, basically. So let's click at you and let's see. Okay, your main body is like destroyed. And so is the right side. So if we can... Let's see. Can you get... Uh... That... On him. Yeah, you should be able to... Take him out. Wait. Uh, critical heat damage. Hold on. So what we want to do is... <laughs> maybe... We're going to be able to run past him, I think. Oh, he's going to shoot us, though. Yeah, we're going to get shot. Um, How you doing here? Yeah, your shot, shotgun's not far enough range. We're gonna need to... We're gonna need to move you, huh? Is he gonna have a line of fire on me? I think he might. Yeah, he's gonna shoot me. We're going to get hurt here. <laughs> Almost certainly. We might want to just shoot him. I don't care about the critical heat as much as uh, us getting shot. I think we're still attacking him, by the way. So he might actually be about to die still. Potentially. Then we're gonna try and shoot this guy with the ranged weapon if we can. Then we get there and attack him. Ooh, maybe. Risk of damage. No, never mind then. He's going to start shooting at us if we don't do something like a flanking maneuver here. Um, 
you do that earlier? Is that like my chance to hit kind of thing or do damage? I don't know. I'm not exactly sure what's going on here, but I think that that looks pretty good to me. Because he's going to run there and then shoot him with his secondary. Um, shield. I want to... Here's, here's the thing that I have a hard time knowing is like, are you going to get the kill with this attack? I mean, damage and volley is 168, and this guy has how much health? Yeah, he should he should get blown up by that, honestly. So, shield, I'm going to have you just kind of run up as much as you, um, as it will allow you. So just kind of keep on running up like this until you can, you're in, uh, in range. Yeah, that looks perfect. And then, um, maybe, is that useful at all? I'm not sure if that stops him from firing on me or not. Um, let's do that. Oh, oh, ow. That was bad. See, I thought that guy was gonna... Is, is he surrendering? What? Surrenders and stops participating. Oh, what? Okay, so he's done. Oh my gosh, yeah. He really should have died there, but he instead gave us a little pummeling. Oh, look at that. We got a friendly... Um, and you're... What? What are you doing here? You're... Oh, that's the, the pilot. What about you? Are you done? I don't think he's done. No, that's the scout, and that's the RD leader. Okay, gotcha. Hmm. Okay, so what we want to do is shoot them as soon as they enter on a fire. And same with you. And you are going to, um, let's see. This thing has like, is that like pretty much full health? No, that's the, uh, that's the pilot. This, this thing's uh, right side is destroyed. So he's going to get, um, taken out by this almost, almost certainly, you know, uh, you don't really need to shotgun him then. What I want you to do then is shotgun this guy when he enters into range, which is going to be, if I run you up, uh, we can probably get you in range much sooner. So as you're running, are you getting hurt? I don't think he's getting hurt at all. That thing's going to start targeting then. Okay, it's super dead but way before that. Okay. That looks like a pretty good point to get him at. So... Yeah, I think that looks pretty good to me. So you're attacking, running, and then attacking. But you're going to actually overheat from that. You might overheat from that second attack. Can I cancel this one? No, I can't. Okay. 
Let's maybe not uh, remove that. When can you do it without overheating? Let's see. What's this going to look like? I'm going to have you run further out like here, actually. And when he gets to like there, attack him. Yeah, that should be, that should be good. And then I want you to start chasing him if you need to. And can you get him again? I gotta hit my friendly. I might hit my friendly. Yeah, it's gonna also overheat us. Okay, um... We should be okay now, right? Yeah. Ooh, he got me with two shotguns there. Ooh, ouch. That's, that's looking pretty bad, but... He's also really hurt on his right arm, so... Shotgun, can you get him? Ooh, actually he's he's got a pretty low hit chance there. Should've chased him. I, I knew I should've chased a little bit closer. That's a um, better hit chance, but hold on. What about when you're here? Yeah, it's that'll, that'll do it pretty well. Oop. And then you're gonna try and fire on him again. It's a good thing that we got movement. Can I, uh, let's see. I think we're gonna wanna get him with the secondary, right? Can I get... Yeah, that's... Uh... Where do we want to aim? Yeah, that looks good. And then... Um, ooh, we're gonna get shot again, huh? What if we fall back? What if I uh, do that? Am I gonna get shot then? No, I don't think I am. Cool. And then from there, oh. No. Looks like, um, kind of gonna take some fire there, huh? What if I... See, there's too many possibilities with this game. Oh man, we're gonna take some fire almost no matter what, huh? Yeah, we're gonna take some fire, but we'll, we'll dish some out too. And then once you're out here, you should be able to get a good attack, right? So your attack range? Yeah, like there. It should be good. And then, um, maybe kind of like run over here as well. Uh, wait, wait till we're done. Well, 
wait until like then and then run and see if you can get another shot from like here hmm maybe not maybe you run in just a little bit closer You get it again. Yeah, we should be okay. I think that that's looking pretty good. Yeah, we're, we're getting kind of messed up here. But they don't have a left arm and their right arm's also about to go. Can you get an iron shot on him? Just like, maybe a little bit sooner. Maybe ASAP. Yeah. We're gonna be kind of um, taking some damage here. Actually, you know what? You're, you're, you're the shield dude. Yeah, so, uh, use it. Let him take his shots. He's not going to be able to do much here. And then after that, you can, uh, just finish him. Oh, he's out of range. Okay, at that point, maybe now he's gonna start shooting. Just hold your shield, and while he's doing that, we're gonna be shooting him and getting another attack on him. Uh, then. What's he gonna do now? He's gonna shoot at me and then just stand there and then attack at that. Okay. So, what I wanna do then is. Yeah, we'll get him then. That should, that should do the trick pretty nicely. Okay. There we go. Good job. Wait, is he... Limp? And eject pilot? Um, should we finish him before that? I don't know. He's just gonna limp and eject. It looks like. I feel like we'll get more stuff by letting him eject, right? So I don't know if anyone's going to come out. So wait, um What's the plan here, buddy? You're gonna limp over here and eject. Okay. Go for it. I'm just gonna wait it out and uh, see how what you do. I mean, he hasn't got arms, is the thing. His upper body is the only thing that's working. It's only got 22 health. So that's the thing. He's gonna eject. <laughs> I, I think it just resulted in the same. Okay, it lasted 30 seconds, the battle, and we inflicted three times as much damage as we took. Good. <laughs> 
We only destroyed one unit. Zero parts. So do we not get the parts because we didn't destroy it? Um, intact. No salvage items. So, huh. Okay, uh, hold on. Let's see. Cussing enemy pilots with attacks from the back or forcing them to eject by destroying the weapons can be useful for that. Yet yeah, avoid destroying the enemy. So we we did the right thing. Ooh, ooh, we got it intact. Look at that. It's that's ours now. We have a mech. <laughs> Are you serious? We, we got a mech from this battle. Salvageable equipment found. That's awesome. So this was destroyed. So these were different types of tanks. Oh, so they've got different loadouts. I, got, I gotcha. So we're gonna have to learn the different loadouts here, huh? Site inventory. Um, what's going on here? Okay, so... And this text is small, isn't it? Fall back outpost when necessary. Huh. Oh wow, you get, you get some good different provinces, so if, the further you get, you'll still be able to have decent units, that's kind of cool. Yeah, um, by salvaging. Yeah, so we're gonna need Switch out people. Uh, we could make a smoke screen. Yeah, let's do that. Let's make one of those. So this is... That what we're doing right now. Um, unit repair and salvaging. Yeah, it looks like that's what we're doing right now. Is time's passing. And we're salvaging here at the mountain base. Okay, so we have... Uh, um, can I just... Let's just see our units here. Splendor and our lance. Our pilots, how are they doing? So I think, are these the ones that we just used here? Yeah, that's why they're tired. Gotcha. I like this. This is pretty cool, though. Very much enjoying this. Let's go ahead and just go a little bit faster, because it looks like it's... Okay. So if I look at my units here... Where's the thing that I salvaged? I'm confused. Can I, uh... We have 16% of recruits here, what's going on? <laughs> I'm confused. I feel like I'm missing something, devs, if you're watching. Because I was under the impression that I also picked something up there. An armless one that was salvaged. Um, 
Okay. We've got... Oh, we've got some different weapons here, huh? Gotcha. So, these are our different parts. We have our upper body. Got some guns. Got our lower body. <clears throat> Do not have a frame, though. So if we look in the workshop, uh, part build. Okay, so we could try and build a frame or a part build. But I think that that's not really anything that we can do right now. I'm confused because I could have sworn that we got another one there. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna complain too much because this game is pretty amazing so far. So good. All right, it's been about half an hour. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.